In this video, we're covering the complications that can arise from a driver swerving on the road. We'll start off with the animation and then discuss a few points. What happened here is that the driver of the green vehicle had slowed down in order to move off into the left-hand turn lane. The driver of the red vehicle approaching him at speed from behind and not paying attention to what's happening ahead of him, realizes at the last moment that there's a danger ahead and tries to swerve out the way. In this particular scenario, he's veered off into the sidewalk and struck some uh, obstacle on the side. It could have had other consequences in that the pedestrians along the sidewalk here uh, could have been a bus shelter and a number of people sitting that could have suffered severe injuries or even fatalities. It could be that the driver now veers off or swerves to the left to try and avoid the vehicle ahead and in that case faces the danger of a head-on collision from oncoming traffic and so you can see there are a number of different hazards that can arise from swerving and in each of the following real life clips we'll have a look at a different danger that arises but in most cases it's the same pattern of behavior that results in this and that is that the driver is not paying attention to what's happening in front of him. He's distracted in some way. Maybe his mind is wandering, daydreaming. Whatever the case is, he's not alert to what's happening up front. In this first real life clip, I've included it because what it shows is that when a driver swerves, it can result in the vehicle being induced into a slide. And once a slide starts happening, People try and overcorrect and land up swerving and spinning completely out of control. And that's often a consequence of a driver swerving. In the next real life clip, we see the driver head. Uh, approaching a track, swerving out the way, but has failed to take into account any faster moving vehicles coming down the left hand lane and so poses a threat to the camera as he swerves out the way. In this real life clip, what I want to point out, because this is something that that I often take note of and that is that when you've got a driver that's coming up behind you at speed now wants to uh, overtake and move into an adjacent lane what happens is that the driver is often keeping his uh, eye focused on another vehicle that's traveling in the lane that he wants to pull into so instead of taking note of what's happening ahead of him his eye is now perhaps in the rear view mirror keeping uh, an eye on in this case, the camera moving down this lane, waiting for the camera to pass before he can see that it's clear to move across. But as he's keeping an eye on the vehicle behind him, he's failing to take note of what's happening ahead of him. Maybe he looks ahead and then suddenly realizes that he's too close to the vehicle in front and so now tries to swerve out the way. So when I'm driving along, I always keep an eye of what's happening behind me. And if I see that a vehicle is approaching at speed and is wanting to overtake me and moving into an adjacent lane, I move over in my lane to the opposite side of the lane that he wants to move into. So in other, in other words, he's moving into the left-hand lane, so I make sure that I move my vehicle more over to the right in order to make sure that he doesn't connect me in the left rear of the vehicle. So be aware of what's happening behind you uh, for this very scenario, which we'll see as I run the clip. In the next real life clip, we've got a vehicle coming down the left lane at speed, quick, quickly and rapidly approaches the vehicle ahead of him and realizes that he's in danger, tries to swerve out the way, but connects with this vehicle that's traveling in this lane ahead of the camera. So where you see this, uh, so say from the camera's perspective, you see a vehicle's now approaching 
at speed, you realize that the point is going to come where he's going to try and swerve out the way. So you make sure that you hang back so that you're not part of that collision. If you're the driver ahead, so if you're the driver of this white vehicle and you're aware of what's happening behind you, you realize that there is a vehicle coming down at speed on your left side. There's another vehicle that's moving slower up ahead of you. So then you realize that this vehicle or this driver is going to want to swerve out the way and cut into your lane, either cut in front of you or sideswipe you as happens when we run the clip. So try to be aware of what's happening around you. So in that case, either try and slow down to allow him the space to pass ahead or move over into the right hand lane to provide him that space to move across again. Uh, but if you're oblivious, you just carry on, then you're going to land up in the situation as it arises when we run the clip. This last real life clip I've included just to show what can happen when a driver swerves because it may not just be his vehicle involved. He can draw in a number of other motorists into his bad driving and so we'll see here four vehicles in total involved. So in other words, a driver and now involves three other motorists in his poor decisions. So as a driver, you don't want to be the person that's responsible uh, for a situation such as this. So always take note of what's happening ahead of you so that you're not the perpetrator of having to swerve and involve other motorists. At the same time, also be aware of what's happening behind you so that you don't get caught up in anybody else's poor driving.
please like, subscribe, and get notified.